Good morning everybody. We, the members of Group B, are here to showcase a presentation on the symbol of India's rich history, Taj Mahal. What do we know about Taj Mahal? The Taj Mahal from Persian and Arabic crowns of palaces is a white marble mausoleum located in Agra, Uttar Pradesh, India. Commissioned in 1632 by Mughal Emperor Shah Jah to house the worldly remains of his third wife, Mumtaz Mahal, the Taj Mahal stands on the southern bank of Yamuna River. The mausoleum is widely recognized as the jewel of Muslim art in India and remains as one of the world's most celebrated structure and a symbol of India's rich history. Regarded by many of the best examples of Mughal architecture, it is a perfect blend combining elements of Islamic, Persian, Ottoman, Turkish as well as Indian architectural styles. The fame mausoleum complex of white dome marble is the Taj Mahal. It, it actually is an integrated complex of many structures. The construction began around 1632 and was completed around in 22 years in 1653, employing around 20,000 artisans and craftsmen throughout the empire. The construction was entrusted to a board of architects, the chief architect probably being Ustad Ahmed Lohari, an Indian and Persian descent. Style used to decorate it. Style used to decorate Taj Mahal was Pietra Dura. Pietra Dura is a term for inlay technique of using cut and fitted highly polished colored stones to create images. It is considered a decorative art. The stonework after the work of assembled loosely is glued stone by stone to a substrate after having previously been sliced and cut in different shape sections and then assembled together so precisely that the contact between each section was practically invisible. This style was also used in Itmadullah's tomb, in Diwane Aam and also in Diwane Khas. About Shah Jah Shahabuddin Muhammad Shah Jah was the fifth Mughal emperor of India. He ruled from 1628 until 1658. He was chosen as successor to the throne after the death of his father Jahangir in 1627. He was considered one of the greatest Mughals. His rule had been called the Golden Age and one of the most prosperous ages of Indian civilization. Why Taj Mahal is damaging? Where the Taj Mahal stands has been polluted heavily by industries and traffic over the past decades. Illegal factories are springing up around the Taj Mahal and uncontrolled construction around the monument seems to be endless. Ground level are sinking because the population around Agra, a city of 4 million people, is growing and needs more and more water. The wooden foundation of the monument may collapse because they are becoming too dry. Yamuna River, which runs through Agra, is heavily polluted by industries around the capital Delhi, which is about 150 kilometers up the river. At the end of last century, the government realized the growing problem and started a program to save the monument's shiny white marble facade because it was turning yellow. Over $150 million was spent on restoration but it did not help much. Corrosion has continued and acid rain has also caused a change in the color of facade. 
Some years ago, restoration experts started putting mud packs around the facade to bring back the building's shiny white color. Government doing for Taj Mahal. The government and the city authorities have taken measures to protect India's greatest site. On Pollution station around Agra monitor air quality around the clock. Car traffic has been banned within 2 kilometers of the monument. Electric and battery driven cars and buses then take tours to the site. National gas pipeline is also in discussion. Factories and industries around Agra should be persuaded to change to cleaner form of energy. UNESCO is preserving Taj Mahal. Thank you and have a nice day. Thank you.